welcome back to Plans on Planning. Here we are in my gratitude planner, and we're going to get the month of September ready to go. -go, -go, -go. How awesome is that? All right, so I already have the numbers in because I know it's super boring watching me put in the numbers. So let's go ahead and get rid of the month of. Let's knock that out. And then I want to get rid of these right here on this side. I just pat it down to get everything looking as pretty as possible. Now I'm getting rid of this because I'm going to put washi in this area. And I feel like on better safe than sorry to have everything sticking up and out of control. And I know you're curious as to washi we're going to use. We are going to use this pretty little washi here. So no rhyme or reason to it. I just really thought it'd be cute to be very, very honest with you. And I liked how the two colors or the two patterns went together. So, yes, I'm still keeping in the floral range with the washi, especially this one because it's, like, leafing. But I like the contrast of dark and light. So, truthfully, that's all it was. Nothing more, nothing less. So, let's get this washer going. So, I'm going to just go over the... So, yeah, we kind of go over the top on this one. So, what I'm going to do is just go to the very, very top of the page. So, yes, it does get in the way of the days of the week it's had. But the days of the week, they're not crying about it. So, I'm not crying about it. Basically. There we go. And go to the next page. right at the darn it right at the top of the page there we go it just really cuts off the very top of it and it's truthfully nothing that serious so there's that and like I said I wanted to put it in this area as well so I'm gonna go ahead and line it up very nice like but giving myself just a tad bit of space there we go and I'm going straight across making sure not to get any bubbles and I'm actually going to double this up So line it up one more time. And yes, it does overlap just a tad. There we go. Bam. I'm going to cut off the excess. Now, normally, I would go ahead and put my smaller washi right here. But because we're cutting off the letters, I'd like it would take up the whole area, basically. And I don't really want to do that this time around. So, I'm just going to start the washi in this area here. Like right here. That's it. I'm not going to go up there. Well, on this side, I actually am. But on this side, I'm not because it's going to take up the whole area. It's going to get funky. It's going to look like too much is going on. So, that's what we're doing. All right, so it's kind of the excess. And let's get to work. All right, so here's my smaller washi, and I'm just going... I'm gonna put it right on here and I'm definitely overlapping 
just so you know. Alright, so I'm just gonna have to use my scissor and cut. And I figured that was gonna happen because of the foiling, the rose gold foiling on it. Because that's usually what happens. See how it all comes together. I totally, totally, totally love it. And what I'm going to do is go right in. Oh, sorry. What I'm going to do is go right in the area. So it kind of gives the illusion that it fills up the whole area because it actually doesn't. And I was a tad bit more gentle with that one because it didn't want to cut up my table. So here we are. And I'm just going up the side little by little is always the best all right so this is what we have on our first side and it looks Pretty freaking awesome if I do say myself, say for myself. So let's move on to the second side. Alrighty. So like I said, I do want to go across the top. And that's because we didn't have, you know, the, the extra washi in this area. So here we go. And we are almost done, which means it's time to get these stickers. Because truthfully, that's all we're looking forward to. Stickers. And then just going down the side. Alrighty. And this one I'm going like just above because I'm not interested in scratching up my table. 
there we go so this is what we have so far and it looks pretty darn awesome to me so that means it is time for stickers all right, so for my stickers, we are using my faith stickers from my Create 365. And as usual, ooh, I like to keep it very simple. And I think I'm putting that there. I think I wanted to before. It says she turned her cans into cans and her dreams into plans. And it gets a little funky, yeah. but... We know what it says. I like it anyway, to be honest. All right. Let's get some more going on. Going on, going on. I like this friend for the end. Friend. I think this looks nice here. I'm just trying to line it up to get under the um the hole punch. Granted, I do have a hole punch, so I could have you know just put it on top of, but here we go. This is perfect love. This is truth and life. Because he is the way, the truth, and the life. Hello. And I like this one. Pray without ceasing. Let's put this up here. Yes. Alrighty. And... This is peace, joy, faith. Haha. <laughs> that looks pretty awesome. I'm looking for something to go right in here. I think this is nice to end the month with an amen. Hello. Oh gosh. There you go. All right. Now, I know it's pretty boring, but that means it's exactly how I like it. Because this is my gratitude planner, and my gratitude planner has a lot of writing and reflection, so I need the space to be able to do all of that. So I like to keep it really plain and simple, um, with just a little bit of inspiration and motivation throughout, and that is exactly what's going on right here. So it's very simple, but it does have some motivation and inspiration throughout it with, you know, the little sayings that are here and there. I thank you ever so much for joining me today on Plan Dead Planning. Thank you for getting my monthly spread together. It definitely looks amazing. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, go ahead and drop it below. Um, don't mind talking to you. I love talking to you. If you feel more comfortable um, actually emailing me about something, anything, then go ahead and email me. You might want to talk something a little more personal your spiritual walk you need prayer things like that so go ahead and email me and we can definitely begin to chit chat that way and create a wonderful friendship um but definitely 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 don't forget to hit me up on social media go ahead and follow me planned on planning um and i look forward to uh seeing you in my instant messages my dms my 
on direct messages. But until then, I will definitely, definitely love to see you there. Have a wonderful, wonderful time.